Welcome back to Sonic Heroes Action Replay. It is time for Bingo Highway. I got bingo. There was a farmer who had a dog, but he's not related. B -I -N -B -I -N -B -I -N. Wait, what happened to the dog? Uh, well, you, you, you got caught gambling again. No! Again. The d collectors are after you, B-I-N-G-O! Ready anytime! See, he's, he's in so much gambling that he has to start selling the letters to his name. No! N-G-O! He's like, oh no, Ingo! Ingo! <laughs> oh no! Go! And then, he lost his name. No, he lost his name Oh. So, <laughs> even though it's Bingo Highway, they decided to put in more pinball things. That's well, good. That's I mean, great. how are you going to make Bingo action oriented? You just phase through that entire thing. Yeah, gotta love it. Like, I can just see Sonic, they just drop him from the ceiling and he lands on, like, five or something like that. And it's like, oh my god, I got Bingo! It's. it's oh. oh, there's this big open thing of nothing here! It's nothing there! Give me something to work with. There's nothing in that big gigantic. And you're down again. Ah. Oh boy. Oh come on. Oh hold on. I, I need didn't to, even. Uh... What, what? I didn't even need to do it. What? There was an alternate path. It was optional. Oh. Now we're going down here. Well, okay then. That's great. Oh hold on. Uh, I I'm getting a message from the future. Now our present. Wait, wait. Hang on. Is it? Is, is it coming from next Thursday? Uh, I, I believe it is. Uh, uh, hold on. I, I hear. I believe they're saying, uh, uh, get good. Mm. I, I hear it. I hear it off in the distance. Yeah, if I get good, then my future self will never get good. It'll be a different future self. So you can tell them to suck my dick! You know what? I have a better challenge for, uh, for the people at home. See if you can comment perfectly B I N G O. And, if you are not able to perfectly go B, then I, then N, then G, then O, from different people, not from the same person, you are all never going to see these videos again. Whoa, whoa! Let's, let's, uh, hang, <laughs> hang on! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hang on, hang on. If you're able to do it, we'll give you, like, I don't know, a pat on the back. Oh, here's Bingo! No, I don't want to touch him! I don't want, I want to, like, I don't want to, like, like... That would be a lot of people to tap the pat on the back. I gotta go all over the country, maybe even like out of the country. To okay, go. maybe just like an internet high five. It's like here you go. To, you go. Well, I, damn it! Now they don't have to do. How do I do that? I can't. I can't embed wave symbols into fucking comments oh, on but YouTube. You can. Here, right here. Huh? But that's not a YouTube comment. That's just a regular high five. No, I'm not saying it's comment. It's a, a high five. It's, a, it's, it's impossible. A, it, it's, it's a bog standard high five. Any, I know, any, and that's anyone. what you're handing out if they so are able to spell I can go out to the grocery the store and get any kind of dollar dollar store brand five. A dollar store <laughs> high five. You want to finish that one? <laughs> <laughs> well, no, because it's it's a dollar twenty five now. <laughs> 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 oh, dude, man! Dollar Store was giving a high five for a buck twenty-five. I think you got ripped off there, oh, man. Oh damn! I need a quarter. Oh no! <laughs> Do you have a quarter for this high five? I need a high five. <laughs> Thanks, Eddie, for the high five. Appreciate it. You know the 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 joke on those Dollar Tree, those uh, like dollar stores or whatever. Yeah. It's like uh, everything is a dollar. Mm -hmm. You're like, oh yeah. <laughs> Post that. <laughs> Is that is that so? Everything is a dollar. Oh, well then, I like to buy the deed to the building that you're in. What? Wait. Can can they do that? It's, everything's a dollar. We gotta give it to them. Well, no wonder they raised the prices to a buck twenty-five. Somebody actually came in and said, "Yeah, I would like to buy the building." It's like that. It's so like that'll be a dollar twenty-five, sir. And I'm like. No I deal. I only got 28 cents. See, that's how they get you. They add the 25 cents, and then you're just like, well, that's too rich for my blood. Can't do it. Wait, he says he got a dollar 28. That means he, that means he can afford it. I don't know. Tax. Uh, <clears throat> it's always the taxes. There are two things in life that are guaranteed. Death and not being able to buy a dollar general for a buck 25. <laughs> Meanwhile, like, oh god damn it! <laughs> god, oh, my god! You know what I wish? That, ah, oh no! Jesus! That's death. You changed the Sonic at just the right time. Uh, well, it when uh, a character falls, but there's another character that you can switch to. Does it do it automatically? Yeah. yeah. Oh good. Because usually when you fall into a pit, you all fall. Because we're all daisy chained together. Yeah, I, I know. I hey, Knuckles is back. Good job. 
You know what would make this extremely aggravating? Just tossing this idea No, please! Out there. I would love to hear I could get even I, more I knew aggravating. you would love to hear this. Yes, please. If every time the AI characters jumped off the ledge, you lost a life. Ugh. Because I have played games where if the AI dies, you lose lives. Yeah. It's awful. That, sound, that sounds like agony. So I think I found out how to fix this level. If you were to change this not to Casino or, you know, the good old B-I-N-G-O, change it to Billiards. Hmm? Yeah, just change it to a giant pool table. Makes sense to me. Good work. I actually played pool recently. And I told the uh, the girl I was playing with, I'm really bad at this. And she was like, well, oh, I am why'd too. why'd you hustle her? Why'd she hustle you? Look, we were both equally terrible, but the thing is, I was able to pull off amazing trick shots, and I even looked at my own amazement. That, yeah, the, yeah, I'm not fucking buying it. I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not, not a shark. I'm not buying it. I'm not a shark. Put it, your fin away. I'm not fucking buying it. Look, I'm more of a minnow than a shark, okay? You're you're a minnow with teeth. You're a fucking piranha is what you are. I will say I was also slightly intoxicated, so <laughs> results may vary. So you didn't even do it consciously. I was more of like the dream state of shark. It's like if you turn it no, up. No, oh, no, no. If you turn a shark upside down, it's just like it's in a constant it. state of, yo, this is great. Oh, right. I love this. But yeah, it was fun. Anyway, yeah, 20 bucks says I can't beat you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the thing is, I replayed the episode of Drake and Josh in my head, where, uh, <laughs> Josh, where Josh didn't know what being a pool shark was, and I was like, am I, really do am I really doing this? And then I hit my next one, and I hit the eight ball in, and I was like, okay, no, I'm actually terrible at this. Sweet. Come clean. I've always it's wanted a pool to table. Lie. I've always wanted a pool table so I could actually learn to play and do it properly. So I used to go to a rec center on weekends to try and learn with my dad how to develop a decent pool technique. And I tried really good for like about, about I'd, I'd say a good half a year, maybe seven or eight months or so, just uh, hitting that pool table as good as I can, trying to hit the ball as good as I could, and. Uh, didn't work. Uh, I'm, I'm terrible. I'm I, 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 that, that is that is no lie. Maybe I'm just giving you a hard time because I'm jealous. But uh. <laughs> see, I've uh, my cousins always had the more sports center things. Like they were the first ones to ad adopt cornhole into our family routines. Ah, uh, cornhole. They had the pool table, you know, back a long time. So they they're really good at uh, parlor games like that. So I've always been jealous of their technique. But there was one small time where I was able to at least get to the final ball playing against my cousin, and he was like, Wow, you've really improved. How'd you do it? And I was like, Pure luck! <laughs> I'm actually pretty good at cornhole. Adrenaline have the thrill of competition, baby! I will say I'm decent at cornhole, but only if I'm on the right side. I don't know, I kind of curve to the left when I'm throwing, so I have to be on the right side so it actually goes near it. You, you good at any games like that? Um, like, let's say foosball and cornhole, the next topic of discussion. I'm not too bad at horseshoes. Oh, we, we need to play horseshoes. I haven't played in a really long time. No, oh, no! No! Oh, I took all my rings. No, can that kill you, by the way? I don't think so, because I had less than, fi I had less than 50. Okay, good. I was hoping it wasn't just a, hey, screw you, luck killed you. That's what it feels like sometimes. Ah, oh, luck just takes you by the hand and goes, Hey, jump in the river with me. And you're like, but what about breathing apparatuses? And luck just goes, nah, you don't need it. You've got me. And then you die. I just realized those AI partners can hit those platforms and cause them to disappear quicker. Uh-huh. That's great. Sort of. Huh. Unless you need those platforms. Oh, I, I, this this team mechanic, I cannot get used to it. I cannot get used to it. You're gonna have to, bucko. You wanna know? You wanna know how you fix this level? Uh, you make it three separate levels: Sonic, Tails, Knuckles. Bam! There you go. But that's a lot of levels. I mean, this is the GameCube. Time is money. It's the same level. We don't have time for that, man. Just do what Sonic did. Just have the. Just keep it the same and have Sonic do it. It's it's fine. And then you do it again, but you race against against Sonic. 
But that's 12 levels, mate. And we then, don't have time for that. And then as Knuckles, you go just have some, have like three Master Emeralds around and you get to, oh, I wonder where it could be. And you climb around the stage and all that, you know, that'd be fun. Do you think any of the Sonic devs, as they were creating all of these extra characters, do you think one of them has a portfolio of fan art? Um, where, where they like ve give Vector a robot arm or something like that, like a uh, bunny rabot. I could not tell you. I really couldn't, because every company deals with fan art differently. Because you know the artists have to, of course, keep drawing the thing that they're drawing in order to yeah. be to animate or repli re replicate it good enough. So there could be an entire folder full of confidential drawings that we're not allowed to see. Like concept art. Yeah. Stuff like that. D d d not even concept art, just just doodles that, that they're doing in a spare time. And, you know, it's like, oh, you know, in my lunch I went ahead and drew, a, you know, a Sonic doing this, and uh, a, t a team from Sega Legal says, okay, take that, and he puts it into a folder and locks it into a locker forever. See, I was just thinking, the, uh, the design of the Sonic Boom cast, I'm just wanting to know if, oh my god, you got a bingo. Good job. Uh, I'm just thinking, like, one guy on his lunch break drew Sonic with a scarf, and one of the head execs comes in and is like, Is that Sonic with a scarf? Uh, 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 uh yes, sir. I, I, mean, you know, I was just doodling him. It, it's, 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 it's kind of, you know, sometimes he wears, well, not, not really, but, you know, it's, you know, it's, what, what do you- I love it! Uh, oh, great, great! I was hoping- Checking that design's going straight to print! Oh, that's good! Wait, wait, straight, straight to print, but that's, huh? the, the, the proportions aren't right, it's, he's like, you know, too tall, I, I, I did it after, like, the, the Nathan Drake, the, I, d His eyes aren't right, but his but, arms are the wrong color. Uh, please, no! Oh, hey, the end. Yep, it's right, it's just right up there, he's gotta- It's right uh -oh. up there. Luckily, this one doesn't kill you. Oh, good. See, this some, level isn't that some bad. Some mercy, but it's yeah, just... This level isn't that bad. I just want to go up. Yeah. I just want to go... Just go up. Uh, right. There you go. Just go up, forehead. Uh, right here. You're going up. You're just, I don't know how these physics are working. You're somehow gaining extra momentum it's, it's, when it's, you shouldn't. It's, it's so awkward. Woo. It's so weird. So weird. It's so, weird. Weird. It's so fucking weird. Hey, good job. Yeah, we did it, though. We did it. We did it. Is this the coveted A rank I keep hearing about for Sonic stages? I wonder if he'll ever get one of those. I wonder. It's not gonna be this time! 9,000 points, no way, that's an A rank, that's a definite... What are you talking about? You got 90-90, that's close to 10 grand. I needed an extra 90, I think. 90-90-90. Oh, that's how you get A ranks. Oh, well. Oh, sorry about your luck. Oh, we're not done yet. Team Dark. Nope. Oh, a uh, special stage. Nope. A boss fight? It's a boss fight! Eggman. I told you! Two X stages, then a boss. Oh. But this means we're on the pinball table. Yeah, so, yeah, it might be some sort of pinball related thing. It might be kind of cool. Oh, Robot Carnival. Oh, that sounds kind of fun. What could... What, what, what could the... It's just wave after wave of robots. Perfect! It's a whole carnival! An entire... Carnival of robots. And that's the boss fight. Wave two! Alright, well, this being the most fascinating thing we've done all level, uh, what's your take on clowns? Level up. Hmm. Everyone I have ever talked to says clowns are the worst, clowns are terrible. There's I don't mind them. There is only one type of clown that I like. Jesters? Not really clowns. They're fools. I should know, being one. Yeah. Cirque du Soleil's clowns. Because oh. they're more, they're more like acrobats and face paint, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of talent behind that face paint. But uh, clowns are most effective when they're funny. I find most of them unfunny. And the horror archetype is too impossible to ignore now. Well, it's because everybody immediately goes to horror. It's like, that's why I'm scared of clowns. Well, yeah, because uh, remember, like, during that time, it was, like, about, what, five, six years ago? Yeah, the murder clowns? You would you would have, like, these clowns standing everywhere. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes they wouldn't do anything. They, they just, like, stand there, do nothing. Yeah. And they still call the cops because it can't be good! 
Well, they, I mean, they're just standing there. They're just standing there. Yeah. Why are they standing there? We got a bunch of Chucky Finsters out there. Jeez. A clown is animated and lightly like, whoa, hey, I'm, I'm clown on the clown. Here to clown my way to the clown clown. And clown you know, it's just constantly moving around, but a clown just, just standing there doing nothing. Do you think anybody's afraid of Krusty the Clown? It wouldn't. I, I wouldn't put it past him. Like, somebody put a hex on Matt Groening because of Krusty the Clown being too scary. Well, some people really are just that afraid of clowns that even seeing just the idea of a clown is enough to terrify them. I understand irrational fears, but everybody no, seems to can't, have No, you can't, because that's why they're irrational! Well, yeah, that's the point, but I understand why people have them. I have an irrational fear. But it's just... Why clowns? They're not doing anything. They're trying to make you laugh. And they're not funny. Well, no, no. If they're not, if they're not funny, <laughs> maybe that's the true terror. <laughs> they didn't make me laugh. There's, there's too many negative archetypes. You know, uh, when you think of clowns, I got three bad ideas right off the bat. First of all, the stereotype of like, you know, the the old drunk, angry clowns, like, yeah, what the fuck do you want, kid? You know. <laughs> so kind of like, you know, uh, Krusty the clown at its lightest, uh, fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Second. Uh, you've got killer clowns from outer space. Never seen it. Well, uh, I'll give you a hint on what the movie is about. Uh, it's about petting puppies in a meadow. It's about a man and a woman. Oh, oh it's one of those. No, stories. killer clowns from outer space. They're killer, killer oh, clowns from outer space. I want to kill you. I got it. They're got they're, it. and they're 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 creepy slash goofy looking fellas. There's of course it. That probably did it. That if that almost was, definitely. That was definitely it, the, it. the the uh, the the the, the, the pre tight grip around the hand uh, and the arm wrestle. That is this no. argument. Now I'll give uh, Stephen King this. The newest versions of it. There was only one scene that legitimately terrified me because it was really good CGI. Which one? The projector. Of course. It was always the projector. We're getting closer! Well, that took forever. B we for had, bashful clowns. We, we had to go on a goofy little tangent. By the way, of course, there's like a... Who is a clown serial killer? Ted Bundy? Ted Bundy, yeah. Ted Bundy, yeah. He was a clown. He was also... Yeah. Well, that did it. Well, now it's time for Team Dark. Team Dirk? Team Dirk. Team Drake. What are they gonna do? They're gonna, they're gonna try the high-speed slides. Hey, I know we're trying to find my memory and all that, but... Let's have some fun on the slides. We, we. Hey, Shadow. We. Oh. What's your favorite console? We. Come on. What's your favorite pig noise? We. All the way home. What's your favorite word in French? We. Matter day. Uh, what? <laughs> that sounded more Spanish. We. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Please save yourself. Thank you. I don't. I don't speak of the French. Uh, f uh, what's your favorite thing to do on 420 Shadow? Weed. Who's your favorite Japanese talent company agency? Weave. Uh, who's your favorite uh, Lord of the Rings actor? Hugo Weaving. <laughs> what's your favorite royal pronoun? We. Shadow, what is your favorite descriptor for something that's extremely cutesy? Twee. What's your favorite fictional alien race? Cree. What's your favorite way to get the fuck out of here? Flee. <laughs> What's your favorite kind of cheese? Brie. What is your favorite vi- Oh, ah! no! You know what? Screw it. I was about to make fun of Gree. Ah! <laughs> Then the frustration kicks in as the poker chips come cleanly into view. You know what show I can't stand? Glee. Glee. Yeah. You know what show I can't stand? Glee. Mm-hmm. No, that's just a general statement. Uh, 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 I, I just whoa, can't see whoa. why you would settle with the... with, like, the Kroger brand of songs. You know, I, I bet if I was in Glee Club, I would be more into it. Possibly. But I wasn't. But from an outsider's perspective, it's just like, wow, I remember that song. I remember when it was great. Yeah, you know, I was, yeah, I was never in, like, you know, a glee club or anything like that. 
I was in marching band, so you know what movie, of course, I flocked to, along with everybody else who was in my band? Do tell. Drumline. Hell yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. That, that's, that's, uh, you know, a little, little embellished and dramatized, you know, for, for effect, but... Just a little. I can tell the people who worked on that movie were in a marching band at some point in their lives. <laughs> oh my god, a chick boy! We did it! Yes. Alright, we're good, alright. Yes. Keep going, folks. Please! Here they come! <laughs> Here they come. <laughs> I think that was the robots talking. Yes, skip the level. Skip it all. Oh, uh, just, just go on through it. Yeah. Give me all the bingo. Yes. Here we go! Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, right, too fast. Right. Too fast. We've gone too far. Can't stop. Uh, we can stop. I'll take it from here. Uh, oh, I fell into a kill, a kill plane because there's so many of them. Oh. Damn it! And there's Knock. another one. Did the checkpoint save? Yes! But they are really just not letting me... Not let me do what I want. Do you think the, all these kill planes are a fail-safe just in case the game mechanics go way too off the rails? Or the physics, I should say. I I, I think they're just there to do what they're supposed to do. Yeah, but like, there are so freaking many, they didn't know- Oh my god, you're gonna make me sick. <laughs> Stop. Sorry. Okay, uh... You see here, you see I have those, those uh, pitfalls there? Because yeah. you, you fall down there, you die. Yeah. I think you ran into one Do of those. I, wait, well, and now you're just you you have made less progress. The reason why there's so many kill planes there is to probably accommodate for that. Hmm. Be my guess at least. Excuse me, sir. Where should I put the kill plane in this level? How much open space is there? Yes. I'll take it from here. D yep. See, there yep, it is. Yep, there's another one. Uh, I've, oh I've, I've, I've no! Gotta, I've got to weave through just so. Otherwise, I'll go into a kill plane like I just did there. Weave. You know what? I'm done with you. Leave. Leave. <laughs> Shadow, no! I thought we were friends. I'm gonna miss you, though, buddy. Kill. I'm going to grieve. <laughs> hey, we brought it back. Reprie. Oh, uh, reprise. Damn it, I got it wrong. No! Oh, no. <gasps> there it is! Yeah, hey, there it go. is! How much cutting did you have to do in this episode, by the way? Uh, no cuts. How much did you cleave? <laughs> is this bit still going on? You better believe. <laughs> there is no reprieve. <laughs> there we go, yeah! Thank you for fixing that! This proves my power. No. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 25. That's my- oh, that's even funnier than 24. Oh my god. I know. Uh, oh, right, we gotta do, uh, this, uh, again. Uh, right, uh, yeah. What was I doing? Time to gamble! Do it again! Well, there really is no long and short way around this. We're gonna have to kill all of these enemies all over again. And that's the reason why this episode is so long, because there is no quick way to do this boss fight. So, what I've done instead is I've fast-forwarded through some of these bits, and they'll just... Yeah, here we go. Okay. Yeah, blah blah blah, dialogue dialogue. Still have the chaos control. Still got chaos control, we still got cheats, but now let's just speed things up. Thank you for this. I was hoping we wouldn't have to sit through the entire... Oh, wow! Whoa, whoa, whoa. I think you found the hidden tripwire that just makes you go absolutely everywhere. Oh, and you died. It was going to be like an hour long otherwise. Whoa! Okay. Appreciate that. So, uh, yeah. Really could have used a gun here. <sighs> no, Shadow, so, you yeah. can't have a gun. No, I, I, I really could have used a rail cannon from a, from a walking mech to just mow these guys down, but nope, that's not cool, guys. We can't do that, because people don't like Shadow with a gun. Oh no, can't do that. And yet they did. In, in hindsight, honestly. Are you still bitter about uh, Shadow the Hedgehog? Ha, huh, my dear viewer, I have never stopped not being bitter. <laughs> That's my that's my secret, Cap. <laughs> I've always been bitter. I'm always bitter. And then he turns into Ultra Director Hulk. 
Who is Cap again? Cap? Yeah. Chris Evans? So something Rod rose it. Oh, yeah. Steve. Steve. <laughs> no! <laughs> now I'm trying to escape the bit! It keeps coming back! Like a relative you don't want at Thanksgiving, they just keep coming back! I had a relative who died. I was the bereaved. <laughs> You got grieve, you got breathe, you got a little bit of everything. <sighs> and now I'm gonna have to start coming up with my own words, just like build words out of nothing. Shreve. <laughs> Freeve. <laughs> yeah, that's a word. What? It can't be. Yeah, it, it's a word. Well, fine then. Eve. It means to be gullible. Ah, God! <laughs> That's like BAM! That's like falling for goddamn up dog! I can't believe it! You actually <laughs> Ooh! Mmm! I hate you. Just like I hate this. Hey, you did it! Good job! Those were the easy ones! Oh. That's i I'm definitely relieved. Oh god, just take it on the sleeve. <laughs> well now Shadow's going away, which means there needs to be a different bit. Or maybe there doesn't have to be a bit at all. Good job on the A. Yeah, right. A natural A. Totally, totally achieved by skill. All right. Gotta try the bingo slides. We, we, <sighs> lo we love the bingo slides. Uh, bingo slides are great. Yeah. You know, yeah. for... For how kid-friendly Team Rose is, I gotta say, the adventure of just ha having fun, I, I kind of dig that. I like vibin'. You like vibin'? Yeah. Yeah, wait. Where are they? Huh. Where, where'd they go? Huh. they huh. Was that their eyes? So, uh, I found a code for invisible characters. Th that that is their eyes. That apparently reduces oh. everything oh. but the clothes they make, chocolate chow, and their eyes, and eyelids. Can that zoom in to Big's disembodied eyes be the thumbnail? <laughs> Everything else works just fine, and at least I can still see their shadows, so that's- that's good. So, really, there's no hiccup. Uh, uh, okay, okay. Still a shorter level, which is good. Yeah. I actually kind of like this code. I wonder if there's one to remove the shadows with the invisibility code. <laughs> what do we call this? Expert mode, that's right. Blind mode. <laughs> Apparition mode. <laughs> the game crashes and you say, No, seriously, it's called blind mode. I'm not creepy pastaing you, I swear! No! Although, Sonic Creepypasta, you got me curious now. I mean, it sounds like a, creep, a creepypasta. I started the game, and then their bodies weren't there, but I could see their eyes, almost like their spirits were still there. Alright, well, actually, we're gonna get a perfect. <gasps> yes! Show let's, me, show let's, me let's, what happens when you get a perfect! Get a, let's get a perfect! Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, five, five, five... That's a bingo. Six... That's another bingo. Good job. I think I'm supposed to switch between characters to get all these efficiently. Pfft, screw it. But I bet the game doesn't expect me to get a perfect. Oh, please crash. Please crash. Please crash. No, it's just gonna throw up fucking rings at me. Oh, they do have an animation for perfect. Of course they would! Well, I, I don't know they're, this. They're, they're Sonic Team, not fucking Utenix. Who the hell is Utenix? The guys that did Red Hell Retribution. Oh, have they made another game since then? I don't think so. Probably for the best. They might have died. Of course, the only people who ever bought that game were people who were just curious about how bad it could be. Do you still own it? Of course I do. In, in, in the scuzziest PS3 case I can find. Like, like, oh crap, I dropped pizza onto one of my, onto one of my games. <laughs> Damn it, let me wipe this up. Ah, that's alright, just a little cloudy now. All right, right, uh, to, right to hell's that's, going that's in good. you. Yeah, that's good. God, that 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 just reminds me of how vastly different our collections have gotten over the years. Yeah, they, it used to be quite similar. Oh, now, very it's... very similar. I own a few bad games plus a lot of weeb trash. Uh... I, I mean, like that people know about. I just I locked my eyes right into a bad game right there. Like that people know. What are you talking about now? Tales of Hysteria. Oh, well, that's because you're a Tales fan. Yeah, no fan of that game. If you're just playing a... Well, okay, I don't actually know about that because I don't play Tales games. But the point I was getting at is you have a lot of games that are just naturally bad. 
No rhyme or reason, just Pardon naturally me? bad. Okay, a few. What? Just a few of them. That makes it sound like my collection's full of shit. No, 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 I didn't mean that. Hold, hold on, let me redact and reword. L yeah, yeah, f f fix it up because you just started World War Five there. <laughs> Oh, nobody insults UDJ's game collection and gets away with it. Uh, no, you you definitely have... G guy who has that much weeb trash has no right to tell me I have a few bad games. Oh, if anything, I have I have more of a say in it because that just makes me a regular YouTuber if I start throwing opinions like that everywhere. <laughs> uh, let's just say you have some of the best stinkers in the business. A few of the best stinkers in the business. There, I, I have I plenty. The of, word I have plenty of excellent games that are mostly dreams come true to me. That's mostly the games I get. But I've got a few legendarily bad games that you just have to. You just you have, have to see, see to believe. Yeah, you have to see. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I still have Sonic 06. That's why I still have uh, st uh, uh, fucking Ride to Retribution. Mm -hmm. That's why I have Rogue Warrior. Yes. That's why I still have this game. Here we go. All right. Wait, did did you pass or oh? Yay, Chocola did it! Oh, good he job. He did it all by himself! Yeah, he, he, no and his, help. he and his three imaginary friends. <laughs> as they just stare at you. So, uh, this should have worked. Uh, we didn't get a key, because, alright, so you just hold L. Does it just skip you to it? If you, if you hold L, R, and X, when you go into the goal, it should oh, take you right to... Please. There it yes! is! Now, so I we don't so we don't have to worry about the key anymore. No big deal. I have to ask though, is this going to mess up with the internal programming of the game? Because if you didn't get the key but still activated the special stage, did the code just give you the the flag for the key, and then the game remembers that? That's uh, I think I think the game takes priority over you getting to the special stage and getting to the the, the emerald and getting it, rather than if you got the key or not. Okay. Just as long, if you fact, if you make it here, it makes sense to the game. In fact, we were so eager to go get this emerald that we we uh, passed it, we passed it <laughs> and we gotta wait for it to catch up. Emerald, 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 emerald. <laughs> I, I like the emerald. I want it. I need okay. it. And there we go. Got it. All right. got the chaos emerald. Man, he's Good on a roll. He's on a roll today, man. By the way, I just noticed that Amy and Cream that's, that's they cheese. Sorry, Chocola is the dadder boy. Oh yeah, or yeah, yeah. I don't know. Uh, I just noticed that Amy and Cream both have extremely long eyelashes and just, like, contact lenses for eyeballs. Because they're girls. That's what they do in the Sonic universe. And then Big just has Monica eyes that are staring straight through your screen. I sold my eyelids. For what? Fishing Bay. Oh, here we go. Ah! Just head. So when you have invisible characters, it doesn't count for when the characters talk? Because they have special animations for that. Oh yeah. So that that's something. That that's just floating heads. Oh no. So the reason why I didn't cut these fights entirely, but just sped them up, mm -hmm. was because they're still unique from team to team. Like different setups of robots. It's it's still like a, a ungodly long gauntlet of, ro of robot enemies, but there's minor differences between them as, as between what shows up when. Interesting. Oh, well, the different colors here. I can I can see that. Some similarities, of course, but it's it's yeah. I mean, you also get Eggman just being a real jerk just outside of the arena. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. <laughs> he pretty much You're a loser. At least for Team Rose, he's like, shouldn't the kidneys be tucked into bed? <laughs> nah, 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 boo, boo. <laughs> <laughs> I do like the very fast bouncing big. <laughs> so they probably made it easier for you. Yeah, because because that's it. So less phases and easier to kill enemies. None of the none of the turtles. Okay, don't get so excited, boys. Uh, t boys. Two of them are girls, and I don't think uh, Cheese has a gender, and I definitely don't think Big has one either. He's specifically talking to to uh, Big's eyes. Why is it so the two big boys that are just staring into the ether. Big, what's your gender? What? Cat. <laughs> no, that's your species, your gender. Cat. Can't, uh, feline or something? No, no, no. Uh, oh, oh, Sonic character. Well, I don't have a code for Team Chaotix. We got to get ten casino what? chips, but uh, I just don't want to look at these guys, so I made them invisible too. Completely invisible. Well, for Espio, it's just you know natural because he can already turn yeah. invisible. Who is Team Chaotix? Will we ever know? 
Will we ever see them again? Will we ever care? Will we ever care? Who knows? Maybe you should play Knuckles Chaotix for the 32X, I think. All right. I guess, you yeah, know I what? Yeah, yeah. Okay, all right. So let's... Yeah, yeah. let's yeah. Uh, Can you look me up the going rate of a I, 32X? If I'm just struck by a certain cosmic radiation is saying, I need to play Knuckles Chaotix for the okay. 32X. Okay. I'm going to need to get myself a Genesis. Well, okay. that can't be too hard. I'd probably get one for like 20 bucks somewhere. 25 yeah. bucks. And I gotta get a 32X. How much is a 32X? Uh, last I checked, about 200 bucks. Uh, 32X shopping. Uh, let's go that was specifically on eBay. Enemies I just realized that... 35 bucks. Oh wait, that's the refurbished service. For yeah. 32X. I got $128. That's a lot. Of course, for the full thing with the, with the two controllers... An adapter, the Sega CD, and the 32X, that's 400 Jesus Christ. So yeah, that's that, that's gonna be about 200 bucks. As for Knuckles Chaotix... That's gonna, that's gonna run you a pretty penny. Old cartridge game. Mm. $19. Really? Oh, sorry, that's $349. Oh, uh, only, only slightly higher. You know, I will say, probably one of the gems in my collection, honestly, is a sealed... CD 32X game. Ooh. All there are only six of them. There, it is. there are only six of them in the collection, and I have Corpse Killer, the least expensive one. Oh wow! It, I, I didn't realize it was uh, sealed. sealed. Wow! Original cool. packaging. Wow. CD 32X, and I got it for like twenty dollars. It's, it's rated M, dude, for realistic violence. Uh oh. God. Yeah, look at that package. Do you, you remember when boxes used to be this big? Yeah, that's ridiculous. And the thing is, people throw those bo threw those boxes out. I was... I know, I was an idiot. Yeah, me too. Why don't I get? Why the hands to you? I got. I grabbed it. One hundred percent full motion interactive video. Take the lead. Do you think Knuckles Chaotix can say they have that? I don't think so. Oh well, then Knuckles Chaotix is just a worse game. Corpse Killer clearly the best. I wonder what makes it thirty-two bit. Or is it just 16-bit and they added a few extra, you know, you know, wibbly doobly graphics things in the back to make it 32-bit? I don't know. I'd like to think that the 32X just add the, added the extra 16 bits on there. Or maybe that's just the compression rate because the video files look absolutely terrible in this game. We're, uh, we, we've seen the beauty of 4K video. Yeah. Here we go! And, I, and I've only had to just trick my brain to go back to that, that CRT filter. You know, I actually, um... Like, I literally had to dig my thumbs in my eyes and go... Ah! Alright! Oh, okay, CRT looks great, actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks, looks fine. So, there is a company that has been upscaling all of these old Sega CD and 32X games. I'm trying to get into this flower, by the way. It's proving to be difficult. It's very difficult. Yes. But they have been... I don't want to say remaking, because that means they're actually changing something. Get they're the fucking... taking the old video there files and upscaling them to HD, which means they are no longer extremely compressed, and they actually look really good. All that for a kid, are you kidding me? So it truly was the Sega CD not having enough power to have, uh, and having to compress videos to fit on the CD and the cartridge. Well, I mean, think about how, uh, far ahead in technology we had to get to put, to get DVD quality. Yeah, it took a long time. That's Sega CD, that's like 1993. Sega, unfortunately, you were ahead of your time at the wrong time. So, so here's where the invisibility character doesn't really uh, come into play so well. It's not working in my favor. I can't see. There hey, we go. There we go. Yeah, and I just realized the main issue with the Chaotix levels, especially the way you're playing. Oh, please. Yes. This means you have to go through the entire level. Uh-huh. And you cannot skip anything. Uh-huh. Cool. So even though... I, I avoided this Let's Play because of the dread I felt with the Chaotix levels. Mm -hmm. Even with the actual replay, it won't let you have fun. I'm still forced. To, and now and now my jump codes aren't working as well anymore. Well, it's because you can't see your character. I don't know what I did wrong. I think I, I was trying to add size uh, enhances, I think, to something. No, that way, that's the next one. Oh, please, no. Just some of these codes aren't working so well anymore. 200? 200? God, you friggin' broke! I was doing so well, and then they decide. Guess what? You don't have any more rings. 
You know, they didn't actually steal your rings. Uh, Eggman just charged you for a copy of uh, Fire Emblem game on the GameCube. The house always wins! <laughs> Which Egg house? Three houses. No! Oh. I, I, I messed up bad in Fire Emblem Three Houses. How so? I got the wrong ending first, and now oh. I can't go back to the other ones because I know how it all ends. Well... And now it's like, oh, I should go back and do the other th the other two endings, but I don't care. Oh, you, you teleported us to Wii Music. You, you're secretly evil. You, I killed you. And, and you, you're not nice at all. Well... That's all I have to say on that one, time. I thought I had more. I didn't. And it's also kind of a middling kind of game sometimes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Careful, careful. It's fine, it's fine. Okay. Please don't fall off the edge. Don't fall off the edge. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Are we? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. You know it's gotten to that point when the only thing you can say is, oh no. You, you, you see what that is up there? That's a flower. That's a cleared bingo field. Uh-huh. We have now looped back to the beginning. We gotta find the two we missed. Excellent! I love Chaotix levels. I love them too. They give me so much joy. They are so yeah. good. They're definitely, definitely the best of the of the of the, of the Sonic 3D games. When it's... I feel like having a bad day, I play Chaotix levels. So I wonder then, why did I tolerate the shadow ones for a while? I mean, yeah, I hated those too, but they were slightly more tolerable. What's it about the Chaotix ones I hate so much? Is it because they're different? Is it because I have the choice? Oh, maybe. If I can, if I, like, I can just give up and go, you know what, I'm not gonna kill all 80 enemies, I'm just gonna reach the end of the stage, I'm gonna do something else to get back to that ending. Hmm. It's possible. I, I, don't, I don't even think they have stuff like, you know, 15 tokens scattered everywhere, I think there are literally 10! There's one! Oh, thank god. Okay, one more. You know, you should probably put a, uh, a health and safety warning at the beginning of the Chaotix part, because this can be classified as self-harm. Please do not hurt yourself anymore, UDJ. It's okay. Self-harm would be if I didn't have codes. Ooh, and I did. It's <laughs> probably up there, isn't it? <laughs> oh, it was! You are amazing! I never would have found that! I gotta think like the game developer. It's like, where would I hide a, a chip? In, the, in a dumb place. That's a dumb place. Let's put it there. Yeah. I love how their eyeballs show up for blinking. <laughs> That's actually creepy pasta material. Who do you think buys all of Big Xylids? I must produce eyelids. They just grow back, and I tear them off. Big is like a crustacean. He just grows limbs back, but he grows back eyelids. I'm not good at fishing because they just don't fight as well. And he puts his his uh, fishing line into a sink. <laughs> On guard, head. Oh, now I just realized if you really wanted creepy pasta material. The reason Big keeps regrowing eyelids is because he accident accidentally cast back his fishing line, the hook went into his eyelids, and then he cast out. That's the true horror. What, what Ren and Sippy uh, episode did that come from? Oh, probably one of the earlier ones. Vector's like, YOU IDIOT! <laughs> what the fuck is this robot? Oh, there we go. Robots, excuse me. They, 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 they zoom back and forth. Yeah, I got infinite team blast, so that works. I am here today. I, I am here, here today to make a historic announcement. I'm surprised you've gone this long without any YouTube poop uh, references. Well, it's because we've run the gambit. We've run. We've run clowns. We've run. Rhyming with Shadow should be a kid's book, definitely. Creepypastas, Chaotix, the 32X. It's been, it's, 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 it's been a journey, hasn't it? <sighs> Techni technically speaking, uh, this counts as a feature-length movie. So I hope that uh, the Oscars will uh, accept my uh, mm -hmm. 
consider this for uh, best director, best editing, best acting, uh, yep. best mm -hmm. supporting actor, oh, of yes. course, Thank of you. course, Thank you. Mm -hmm. best makeup, you know, uh, 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 you, you look ravishing today, feeling kind of glam today, mm -hmm. you know, best best hair, uh, you know, I think uh, that's a. Uh, Clearly, you, yeah. Yeah, yes, thank you. Uh, best original song, Chaotix here. Right. Taking oh, it away, Chaotix. right? Mm, yes, yes, brilliant. And of course, uh, best cinematography. <laughs> we took off the green screen masks off of them just so they could speak. Good job, Chaotix. You did it. Hey, they look how I feel empty. <laughs> so, what's gonna happen next time? Oh, well, next time we're going to. We're gonna grind. <laughs>